Hi, I'm Brian, and you're watching Someplace or Another. And today I'm at the Steam Orama in, in Hall Town, which is just southwest of Springfield, Missouri. Let's go check it out. <laughs> All right, here's the flea market. Yeah, like that. I got here and the parade's already started, so let's go check out some tractors. Actually, you've already seen a few, haven't you? <laughs> hmm. I never noticed a little gearing in there. Look at that. First, let's go check out the engines. What do you think of those steam tractors? Pretty cool, right? Looks like we found an old Chevy. Chevy had an overhead valve. Yeah, I, I noticed that. No valve covers yet, or side covers. So you can see the top of the lifter, you can see the push rod, you can see the rocker arm, you can see the top of the valve. Yeah. Not good for dirt, but I guess it gets the job done. Oh, it was it was far advanced to yeah. a Ford. Like I say, Ford didn't make one until 54. 1954. Wow. Chevy and Buick had over at Bounce from the beginning. Ah. Thanks. Thank you. 
Tri Track from back. David Bradley. The, the uh, 1952 uh, John Deere Model M and owned by Randy uh, Skeeters of Stratford, Missouri. Okay, here's a pile of motorcycle old steroids. <laughs> 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 it's turned the steering wheel, they all kick you right here. Wow. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Yes. 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 That's cool. seen the video or not but the the Bradley back there articulates three wheels and articulates and apparently tips over extremely easy <laughs> so if you have one be careful speed up done with the engines but we're gonna move over to steam a little variety plus it's kind of picturesque over here <laughs> that building's new in case you guys don't remember this is her second year at this location Check out all the steam lined up. Let's check out this case. I like how they're using signs now. You guys want to see the sorghum? I walked right past them on the way in. I was trying to get the steam tractors. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go back and check it out. Coming too far. Or I could just walk around. <laughs> I 
didn't see this guy last year. detail in such a small amount of space. <laughs> Very cool. I'll give you two thumbs up. Or one thumb twice. <laughs> Check out this old international. Got a lot of construction going on. That building. Pretty sure that building's new. Another one going up there. Another one over there. Steam tractor moving. Can you imagine how much longer that took to do? than today. He's going to fire up the pump for us. That is to monitor. They got their pony brake going over here, so let's go check that out. They're weighing the tractors right here. At least that's what I think they're doing. Let's go check that out.
go up here and see what's going on. Uh, m and diesel. This whole section is brand new. We will definitely be back exploring that. But right now, I got the steam the tractor powering a sawmill. I stand corrected, it's a shingle maker. little Peterbilt. If I stand really, 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 really close, then it might look full size. That's still pretty cool. It's 1966 Ford. Look at that Dodge. International. I like that. That's cool. It's a Chevrolet Apache. Chevy, green buyer. Use that to travel someplace or another. Check out that. Check out this 1969 Ultra Van. It's actually not that large. If you compare it to a truck right next to it. They used to use Corvair motors. And then I switched to Oldsmobile, I think. See if it's like a peek inside. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Mind if I look around? <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> Do you mind if you're on YouTube? No, I'm on Chinese YouTube. It wouldn't surprise me if I'm over here too. <laughs> <laughs> you're on Chinese YouTube? Yeah, playing Elvis music while they're looking at our cars. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> pretty funny. <laughs> All right, well, that's pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> Maybe a little annoying. All the amenities. That looks pretty nice. Yeah, it still works. We went camping last weekend. Sweet. Yeah. That's, that's the commode. That's the, uh, yeah, the throne. Oh, that's the, the throne? Ice blocks in there. You're good for about four days. Oh, I shouldn't have opened it. Now it won't close. Slam it. Slam it? Everything's structural. Okay. <laughs> this is a big egg on wheels. It's not mine, so I don't like to do that kind of thing. Well, it's, it's a everything in here is not bolted down. They're not bolted down. Well, that way you can turn them this way and make a bed out of this, or you can turn them completely around and have 
Kind of that way. You can have four people. That's just cool. <laughs> you weren't here last year. This van, I don't think, was here either. Oh, the windows are down over here. So, in case you didn't know, the engine's back there. Because that's where they put them in the purveyors. A little heart, 40 horsepower, if that. And what's your stuff? A little Farmall? 27 Hurt. <laughs> I definitely need a bigger garage. Fairlane. It's funny how the Ford Ranger, this is like the same size as F-150. <laughs> Actually, it's smaller than the new one. Here comes old Ford. Or it might be a Ferguson. No, Ford. It's new. It's like a tram stop right there. Well, that's pretty cool. This is for the guys to put the show on. Well done. It's like, I feel like it's twice as big. Maybe not twice as big, but you've spread things out just right. And uh, it's pretty cool. I can't really imagine what next year is gonna look like. So much has changed in just one year. Good job. Let's stop by and check out this advanced and rumly oil pool. Let out. Harris. Model A from 1935. There's a Waterloo. 
I don't, you guys probably don't remember. Well, some of you might. I went to the John Deere engine plant in Ohio. And I learned the history of like Waterloo and John Deere. It was a pretty neat place. Well, a couple riders. <laughs> Someone's going to regret that when millions of people see that video. This is the old farts car. Looks like it. Oh, that's international. I almost, almost got in trouble there. There's a redneck taxi down here. see here that's a New Holland SP 166 self propelled square baler from 1956 not really as smart as I look <laughs> Nineteen fifty Harris Power Horse. Very nice. Awesome. There's a cat. What the heck? Hmm. I'm not sure what that caterpillar was used for. A little boom on it. That's cool. Got a grater. Dozer, Caterpillar, and Cormac Daring. So I had the bus problem and I had my doctor over to see him and he goes, what are you doing here? You know, right off he asked me, that's for the vaccine. That's pretty cool. So anyway. Lots of economy engines, but I don't know if I've seen an economy tractor. Huh. Well, that's pretty cool. <laughs> this is a good spot. Camera-wise, bad spot wind-wise. I need goggles to stand over there. It's flight of my eyes. It's the walk on the other side.
<laughs> he did! He put a block on that. <laughs> Well, that's much better than by hand. Very cool. <laughs> Now that's a corn truck. Thanks for watching today's adventure. I will see you guys someplace or another. This is a pretty cool tractor show. And so far the rain has held out. For the most part, it's misting a little bit. <laughs> you guys have a great day. Bye.